What's up? So there's a lot of drama going on. Trey Bill's side chick apparently shades Harry. CJ gets exposed again and speaks out. Fredo calls him out. Expose you, bro. Chris shows off his shrimp and Queen Nija unites with her family. But is there still drama there with clearance? So let's get straight into the drama. A lot of people, especially Aerie fans, were hitting me up saying that Trey has been cheating on Aerie when they were in a relationship. I have a whole file with all these receipts and a lot of those things actually debunked. But anyway, I don't know if I want to do a video on it. Maybe give my video 8,000 likes and I'll do it for you. Only you, if I get 8,000 likes. If I don't, I won't do it. But anyway, apparently this girl pulled Trey from air. It all started because she was getting dragged by fans. They evil! So she, I guess, had enough and ended up saying this. Now you ain't gonna destroy our neighborhood. It's... You look like a baby though. <laughs> did, we, did we say her name wrong? I don't know her name. So I don't give a fuck how you say it. I'm not gonna jump on my live and just... Ari. 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 She the I don't understand why they're shading Aerie just because the fans are dragging you. Well, how is that Aerie's fault? Who let the dogs But anyway, and regarding Trey, you guys said that he did respond to Prime, basically indicating that the tweets that he made in my previous video weren't towards Prime and his friend. He responded to Prime saying, Why y'all boys trying to act like y'all the only ends I know cut the goofy-ish, bruh, for real? He was dogs before all this internet ish. Y'all really just inserted yourself, bruh, to be honest, but that's how you feel, say no more. I've never been on no gay-ish, flawed, jealous-ish, and you know that, Prime. Always came to you man to man. You got it though, gangsta. <laughs> so yeah, those tweets apparently according to Trey weren't towards Prime. And it doesn't look like Prime responded to that apologizing, so I, I don't know what happened. But anyway, let's move on to the next drama. So a girl on Twitter recently tweeted, hey man, what kind of family man wanna pay for pee? You got like six kids. <laughs> and she showed a receipt of CJ basically asking her to come to Vegas and offering to pay. You know his naive fans are gonna be like, maybe he just wants to hang out with her and buy her lunch. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, After the incident happened, and royalty posted on her IG, Sis, you ain't seen nothing yet. I don't know what the hell that's meant to mean. It's gay, gay! My mom! CJ ended up posting, My Twitter CJ so cool one is hacked, and Bruh. I am not associated with anything Twitter related. Thank you. Jesus Back to positive Christ. vibes while randoms are trying to break us down. Okay. And his account on Twitter is down. I don't know. I really... CJ lies a lot. He's been caught lying before. Remember, remember when he cheated on royalty and then he lied to the whole internet and then royalty end up exposing him for being a liar? And then I had found out he did. Girl, I cut him. That's was hilarious CJ now no one ain't gonna trust you this isn't the only time that CJ has offered to pay and he even paid the previous girl $2,600 so CJ is someone who thinks just because he has a lot of money he can pay some girls to be quiet and obviously it didn't happen last time and that was so funny bro remember that that was all our video he was lying but my pregnant girl my fiance the mother of my future kids the person that I've been with for seven years almost I have not done her the way you guys are saying I've done her. Where I got cheated on, cheated on, cheated on, cheated on. And she's still here. She's actually laying down on bed rest where she's supposed to be. I knew about this for a while. During all that, 
There's no confrontation in our house. There's no arguing. There's no cheating. There's no speculations. Have a blessed day. So now you're in a situation where you're basically running away from the situation and you're all quiet. Royalty is going to be quiet because that's embarrassing. Again? Wow! Now the woman's page also got taken down, which was very interesting. And I'm just like... Did they mass flag her? It was just really weird that CJ and her page like got taken down. Like you can't find it. Well, I can't find it anyway. Anyway, you know Pretty yeah. Boy Fredo was so excited about this ish, so he ended up going on Instagram live dragging CJ. Some drama is about to happen! And know what Matt Miller said? One thing I won't do is pay for And y'all tell royalty if she wanna ruin this she can come my way. Yeah. And I said that shit for real. You're not my type. Let me make that clear. You're not my f type. I like natural girls. I like natural, straight natural, you know what I'm saying? No surgery, none of that shit. But I'll treat you better than that lame treated you, okay? Because that steady chin on you, he a lame. And if any- It's so funny, Pretty Boy Friday was like, oh, royalty, I could treat you much better. You can't even treat Jasmine better, bro. Sweetheart. I have six kids. Oh my God, you have six kids. My you've had enough. You're done. Shut the f up, bitch. No more, like, no more, bro. You've had enough. Six kids. Bitch, what? Look, it's time to put your d in retirement. Hang that shit up, bro. And I don't even want this live. I'm only giving you a little bit of clock because I don't like you, much. I don't like you, bro. Oh my god! She threatened me! And the moment I woke up and I seen that shit, I had to laugh, bro. You over fire. No cap. Do you think those CJ messages are fake or real? Let me know in the comment section below. Anyway, let's go on to the next story. Chris Sells was basically showing off his junk on IG Live. Now, I cannot show you the video footage. I can show you this picture. Ew. God bless. See you later. Jesus. Anyway, this went all over YouTube and the T pages. Everyone was basically laughing at him. Y'all lucky y'all not me, man, because I've seen it. When, when he exposed himself ages ago, people were spamming my DMs and I got nightmares for a week. Because I've never seen something like this before. I was like, what the hell is that? How did Queen take that? This man was legit flaunting it on his IG line, like touching it and stuff. And I was like, eh, this man like really trying to show it off. Like it's a shrimp. What the hell? Like a fish hook. Quarantine me! People were commenting. What God has for me. Oh no, stop covering Every time you're about to eat shrimp, you're gonna think of Chris Sales. Disgusting. Okay, let's move on to the next story. Queen Nija and her family are having a reunion. And of course, a lot of people are like, what's going on? You guys know I already covered this story in previous videos. So, well, if you don't know, you can go check them out and get up to date. But a lot of people are wanting to know what's going on with Clearance. Is Clearance going to be cool with the family again? And it does look like they're hanging out, but Clearance is nowhere to be seen. You see also? <laughs> No, period. No, say, I don't play that. Period. I don't play that. See? No, are you letting me? So, and he hasn't tweeted anything. Until he tweets something, then everyone's gonna be like, okay, they're a happy family. As everyone has said something, even Lee's cool with Miss Reva, so the fact that Clarence hasn't said anything is just sus. Anyway, people had this to say in the comments about the whole reunion thing. Yeah, that's a tough situation, especially when everyone on the internet knows about it, you know. I bet you they're probably getting bombarded with people asking them, What's going on? Is you okay with Clarence and your friends? Like, damn. Anyway, guys, make sure to smash that like button, hit the subscribe button with notifications so you don't miss out on any of the drama. And I'll see you guys on another drama video.